back to another vlogmas video now guys i am so excited i got up early this morning i got myself ready i worked a little bit already and now cameron is still sleeping i'm gonna wake him up in a few minutes but i wanted to talk to you guys really quickly first so yesterday when cameron was getting a haircut i had two packages delivered now both of the packages were actually supposed to be delivered like next week so this wasn't even supposed to happen today but when he was getting his haircut i snuck down to the package room i got the packages i hid them in the baby's closet which we don't really go into often, yet at least. But I have two surprises for Cameron today. Now, the surprises that I have for him are probably gonna make him like pretty emotional because anything that comes to the baby, like we both get pretty emotional because we're so excited to be parents. And although that they're not necessarily just for him, like the one thing is kind of for me, him, and the baby. And then the other thing is kind of for like me and him and like our family members type of thing. But I know because I went out of my way for it and I got it specifically to surprise him with, he'll definitely appreciate it. And also I did want to mention like one thing that I feel like is kind of overlooked when you become pregnant or like when your partner becomes pregnant or whatever the case may be. I feel like the dads don't necessarily get as much like attention in the sense where all right, let me explain myself because that might not sound right. So like when the mom is pregnant, obviously like I feel the baby, I can possibly feel the baby kicking sometimes. He doesn't quite feel it yet because like I'm not like so, so, so far along where like you can see the baby's punches and kicks yet. But like I feel the pregnancy. I feel the love and the connection between me and the baby. And not that he doesn't, but obviously it's a little bit harder and more effort for the dad to connect with the baby because it's not inside of him. And because I'm the one pregnant going through all the symptoms and stuff like that he's the one that's been mostly taking care of me as like you know a man should take care of his partner during pregnancy but i just want to show my appreciation toward him because i want to be there for him mentally and physically if he does need it and i think that these gifts will definitely like show him like babe like i appreciate you i love you so much and although i do say it to him all the freaking time i feel like gifts are one of my ways of showing my love so i'm really excited to give it to him and also another thing cameron and i have always been the type of people even from like the first year of our relationship, we both take care of each other in the sense of like gifts. Like Valentine's Day is not just a holiday for the man to surprise the girl. Like I like to surprise him and we kind of like to keep things not necessarily even because he always tries to outdo me and I try to outdo him, but he always takes the cake. But yeah, so I definitely want to make sure he feels appreciated and he knows that I'm thinking of him during this whole baby process. Even though he knows that, I just, I don't know. I'm overthinking things. It's pregnancy hormones. What do you want me to say? <laughs> but all right, so I think I'm going to wrap up the gifts because I didn't have a chance to do that yesterday i didn't have enough time and then i'll wake him up maybe we'll have a little breakfast slash lunch because it is kind of getting a little bit late in the day and i'll have him open up everything so i have both wrapped gifts right here this one i kind of under cut the wrapping paper so we're just gonna keep it like that and just not let him flip it over but comment down below what you guys think that these gifts are i'm just standing in our guest room and sometimes i come in here and i just look around because this isn't gonna be just a guest room for much longer like this is gonna be our baby's nursery. The guest bed is gonna be out of here. That whole setup is gonna be out of here. A crib will be in here, a changing table will be in here, a glider will be in here. It's gonna be decorated for our baby. Like 
it's just crazy like we moved into this apartment with the intentions of like having this as a guest room maybe one day it'll be a nursery and like the time is here it's just crazy to me babe baby why are you screaming like you're about to get like <laughs> i'm recording for our vlog channel video okay Vlogmas. Vlogmas? Another, another Vlogmas? Another Vlogmas. Our nursery. Isn't it crazy that this is going to be our nursery? Mm -hmm. I can't wait to change it over. And I've been trying to tell you that we need to get this bed. I've been saying that we need to get this bed out of this room. I've been trying to tell you that. But we've had guests. So how are we supposed to get rid of Yeah, but we got to blow a bed. Like, no one, everyone's going to understand everything. Like, the pregnancy announcement is out. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, like, everyone's gonna understand that, like, even if we don't have a bed in here and we're already, like, transitioning, like, mm -hmm. they're gonna understand that if they gotta sleep on a blow bed. So, should couch. we get rid of that? I've been trying to tell you that. I'm scared. I'm, like, scared oh to take God. the plunge, like, to get rid of the bed. Like, that's a big deal. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> yes, it it's is. It's transition, you know what I'm saying? I know. We really have to, um, get ready for this changeover in this room. I know. Well, I have a surprise for you. What? The crib? No. Yeah, I, I have the crib in the closet. Like what? No. What could be in a box and you gotta build it? Yeah. Girl always has something up her sleeve when it comes to presents, bro. Every single time. Okay, I'm gonna put the small one up here. You open up the big one first, and then you could open up the small one. Any guesses? I don't know. Like a like a changing like. I'm guessing babies, okay? Because Why? now that me and Trish are pregnant, we have been giving <laughs> each other, like, you know. Little, little stuff. Yeah, and all like that, but now, like, we talk so much about, like, now it's not just us. So, like, when it comes to presents, it's not yeah. like, oh, a Gucci belt or a jacket yeah. or something like that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Or shoes. It's, like, more so, like, something for the baby, and we can gift it to each other. So. That's, a, that's one thing. I love getting, like, baby stuff because it's not just for us, you know? I'm thinking it's, like, a changing mat or something. But when it comes to presents, I'm, you know what I'm saying? The kid comes out of it. Like a book bag. Look at it. Do you have any idea what that is? A book bag? It's our diaper bag. Oh, babe. <laughs> it's our diaper bag. Open that up. Here, I'll hold this. <laughs> oh, so you put, you put the dirty diapers in there. Or <laughs> not dirty diapers, or like soiled clothes or whatever. I didn't even open it all yet. That, you put a pacifier in there. Oh, wow. A little teether. Yo. And then those are stroller straps, so like you can hook the bag up onto the stroller and it could hang from the handlebar. Not me over here getting like all like happy and whatnot over a diaper bag. That's what like, I'm saying. Like our like loves for things has completely changed. Yo, this is fire. This is Isn't like this, nice? this is like a full on like travel equipped diaper bag. Like, so all I see in here, guys, is just. Like, oh, I think you guys can't really see, but there's just a lot of, like, sockets and pockets, mm -hmm. like. So, you know I've been doing my research since the day I found out that we're pregnant. That, like, I've been looking into cribs, diaper bags, everything. So, this is actually a, like, you okay, can take me, this off. Let me, hand, let me hand the diaper bag to, like, the person yeah. who created okay. it. And <laughs> created us, it. And can tell us all about it. <laughs> okay, so this is a diaper um, fanny pack. So you can actually take this off and like if we're just going on a quick run somewhere, like you can put like diapers in here and wipes and it's just like a quick little thing. If not, then it's just another pocket. And then look, you can put a pack of wipes right there. Look, and you could just open up the wipes and just take oh, one out. Oh, that's what that hole is for. Yeah. We'll probably put like, I feel like Clorox wipes there, not baby wipes. Well, a whole bunch Clorox of wipes for what? Like, just in case we're, like, quick, like, out, like, if we need to sanitize something before we put the baby in it or something like that, okay. you know? I wanted to clarify that because I don't want to, you know what I'm saying, Clorox oh. wipes for the baby. No, not for the baby, for, like, cleaning, you know what I mean? Pockets in there and stuff like that, something in here, because I knew you wouldn't want, like, a diaper, like, purse, you know? And then on the back, this is the selling point that I feel like you would really like. So, ready for this? It's a freaking changing pad. 
Oh. Uh, so if we're on the go or in the car or wait, something, then when you can flip this down, I was like, wait, what is this? Like a, a seat for the baby to just sit on? Oh. <laughs> I was like, no. No, it's a changing pad. Oh, wow. So if we're in the car or something, and then here's again the wipes. This would have baby wipes in it, diapers, you know, creams or whatever. And then we could change the baby on Yo, the go. Oh, this is. I'm this is like an all-in-one book bag right here. That's so cool. And then I did get this too. That's crazy, but babe. This one is more for like for this me, girl. kind of. All in mommy mode. You see her? Look, this one's kind of for me because I feel like you wouldn't really use this one. But this one's like a purse. I know you got yourself something. <laughs> okay, well I had to. But so this one is like this one's nice and big, so it has everything. Oh, we got teethers in there too. Yeah. Uh huh. And then you could actually wear this cross body. I mean, you could probably use this if we need it. What? Babe, I'm not wearing that. Well, you don't have to wear it, but if we're out together, no, just I'm like how sometimes that. you carry I'm not my wearing, purse. No, I'm not wearing that. Okay, so then this will be mommy's mommy bag. Yes. I kind of cut the wrapping paper a little too short, so just open it up like a little kid like you usually do. Okay. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Doppler. Uh <-huh. laughs> now we can hear our baby's heartbeat at I home. know, I know. Because there's some appointments where you can't come in, and like I know you always want to hear the baby's heartbeat, so I figured now we can do it whenever we want. Wow, man. Yeah? This is like everything right here. Good. I'm happy. Now, like at night, we can listen to the baby. Wow, man. Like. This girl always thinks about the most, like, like, even though, like, like, she can think about, like, the little gifts, the big gifts, the memes, like, gifts. All of them, like, wind up coming out to, like, the best thing ever. Aww. I can't wait to hear her baby start beating. You want to do it now? Yeah, that's something I've been craving. Me and Trish have been craving listening to our, like, mm -hmm. artists able to, like, like, we just really want to just, I don't know. We're so excited for our baby to come here in the world and... Like, we just think about all the time about seeing the baby. We always look at the app to see how, like, big the baby is. We compare What's it to, like, happening? food. We compare it to, like, the food sizes. So, like, um, is it still a radish? Or... No, this week is a, um artichoke. Artichoke. Yeah. Yeah, so we're so obsessed with our baby. And, like, this is just something that's going to make it even more emotional for us now. Like... Mm -hmm and times where we just want to hear the baby and we understand the whole entire thing like you know this could be also scary because i heard a lot of yeah. people say that sometimes people like get scared and worry because they can't find the heartbeat and stuff like that mm -hmm. um but, so we'll, we'll use it with like discretion like okay right. if we don't find the baby's heartbeat it's not like a problem it's just we can't find it in that moment maybe the baby's positioned weird. wow this is crazy yeah so you want to use it yeah thank you baby of course you look like wow. a whole daddy with your backpack on, with your fetal monitor. <laughs> Cam finding his heartbeat. <laughs> Got a strong heartbeat. What can I say? I'm in love with you. Oh. <laughs> Gonna get some brownie points. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys. So we are ready now. We have the gel. We have this all right you can come up my area don't get in the way <laughs> another thing that's crazy guys as i'm getting like trisha ready for everything so you guys can hear hey. it too another thing that's crazy is that okay see i say don't get in the way <laughs> is that like it's crazy that there's two hearts like i think about stuff like that i i think about like deep down like into things like that you know what i'm saying like this mm -hmm. girl has two heartbeats inside her body which is insane two brains yes yeah, so. tell me how i have two brains and i feel like my brain is not working properly these days. Like I'm a nurse. <laughs> Crazy thing guys, uh, Ooh, I was gonna go to school to be a nurse. I was gonna go to school to be a male nurse. Why? What did your one teacher tell you? He said because male teachers make a lot of money. I know this is a Male nurses, there's a lot of females is what he said. What? I... Yeah! <laughs> All right, guys, so we found where the heart's at, so I'm gonna go over to it now. <laughs> I'm crying. The 
listen to my baby in there. Okay, baby, talking back. All right. doing this for hours <laughs> like we're bored we don't know what to do that's crazy the doctor said or the nurse or whatever was saying like you get the holy like, fucking like minute or so to like see like the heartbeat i don't know guys in the comment section what you think it is i'm calling a boy That's why I got you this. Daddy and baby. That's baby talking. Baby said, I think that's me breathing. <laughs> that's crazy. It's a boy. <laughs> no, it says high 140s. That's girl. No. It's a boy. <laughs> so, babe, rate my surprise 1 through 10. BMS, baby. BMS. You like your surprise? I cannot song? rate that at all because that was such a loving and emotional present for me. Um, honestly, guys, like when it comes to the whole entire baby and everything, like people say that like when you have a girl, like it opens up the dad more. But just me and Trisha having a baby is opening up like the softer version of me. Like you know what I'm saying? Like it's opening up that part of me more. So, like. The two gifts that Trisha gave me today was honestly so, 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 so amazing. This is something I'll always remember because I got to hear my baby's heartbeat at home for mm -hmm. the first time with my yeah. loving wife. I love the sound of that. To be. <laughs> I love the sound of that. <laughs> yeah, guys, that's like the next big thing, you know what I'm saying? Okay, you don't oh, have to list. say it. You don't have to say it. Who's God? I got food in the microwave right now. <laughs> hey guys, today has just been a great day. That's why I'm just so joyful right now. I'm in a, like a great mood right now. Mm -hmm. Got to hear my baby's heartbeat at home. I got my first diaper bag. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, I know you'll probably want a luxury one, but at least we have, you know, something in the meantime. Yes, yes. I can't wait to use that baby. I can't mm -hmm. wait for us to be out and actually like me whipping out the book bag, changing out like the whipping out the changing thing. Everyone's gonna be like, what kind of book bag is that? That's what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Uh, that shit is mad impressive. I'm going to say, oh, you're talking about this one? Oh, yeah. My wife right here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> she just got me this, you know what I'm saying? So back off me. If you want it, just look at the tag. Skedap. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're definitely going to be getting, like, the DILF looks. The DILF? Yeah. I don't think it's called DILF, babe. Da it's like MILF, but with dad in front. No, it's... Oh, I see what you're saying. Who has the pregnancy brain? But anyways, guys, we're going to close out today's vlog channel video right here. I hope you guys enjoyed, and we have a lot of things in store for this Vlogmas. If you guys are excited, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to our channel. This week, we have some exciting things. We're going to go dress shopping for me for our gender reveal. Oh my God, guys, the gender reveal is coming up. Ah! Yeah, we'll, we'll get into that. You guys will know a little bit more probably when we are shopping for my dress, but just know that will be coming later this week. We're going to be shopping for my dress. We need to shop for camp stuff. We need a gender reveal plan. I'm really excited, but the gender reveal guys is coming up shortly. I have no direction in if it's a boy or a girl. I have no direction. I had a dream the other day that it was a boy, but I've also had a dream that it's a girl in the past. Oh, I have no direction. Oh my God, we have to do the old wife tales. We have to do that. And we also have the anatomy scan in a couple weeks. That you guys will be seeing too. Close, There's a lot of stuff coming up. So if you guys want to be a part of this journey, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to our vlog channel and stay tuned for more videos. With that being said, we love you guys so much and we'll see you in the next lit video. Stay, stay lit. lit. Peace. Peace.